Hello everyone. So today let's look at some common mistakes that we all make when we start off with yoga when it comes to Chaturanga or Chaturanga Dandasana. So here are a few observations that I've made not only on myself when I started yoga but also on my students that I observe every day. So common mistake number one, shoulders are not protracted, they are collapsing. So already in plank, the shoulders are collapsing, the hip is collapsing and people start in this pose in Chaturanga and then they try to go forward and they collapse completely. So that's mistake number one, where you want to protract your shoulders in plank pose, shift the weight forward, keep the protraction and take your body down. So that was mistake number one. Mistake number two is one shoulder coming down before the other. So maybe I can show you this way. So generally what people tend to have the tendency to do is the right shoulder or the dominant hand shoulder will be stronger. So they shift the weight forward and they go down and then come up with one shoulder. So try to avoid one shoulder going down more than the other. That was common mistake. Number two, the last common mistake in Chaturanga Dandasana is without trying to shift the weight forward, going down completely just here. So you see people going from plank, they just try to bring the elbows in and go down all the way. And then coming up into cobra and down go. So the key is that you want to be in plank, you want to shift the weight forward, and then you want to go down. And then come up into up dog and into down dog. 